Hi everyone and welcome back to another update on the tower defense game that I am making. This is still in beta 0.5 but I want to show off the uh, particle systems that I promised I'll show you when I, once it was finished and it's finished now and I've added some uh, some more features to to the particles. So uh, right off the bat you can see here we have the blood effect here so we can go ahead and uh, click that and uh, we can change it to mild average and bloody and off complete off so this is actually going to determine how many particles uh, are going to be from each um, from each shot like if you get shot by a bullet and it's on mild you'll get two blood particles and if it's on bloody you'll get six um, so uh, it, it determines how many blood particles you want if you are playing a level with a lot of monsters it's probably a good idea to have it set not to bloody because it's going to crowd up the screen and uh, Hopefully not, but it might make it lag. Uh, I haven't actually tested it out. I have begun working on some levels that, um, because the level system is final now, I think I don't think I'm gonna add any more features to the level system, so I can go ahead and ma make maps now. But I think uh, we should show it first. Uh, you've all seen it with the off, so let's uh, go into mile and load it up test level here, and uh, let's go ahead and start the game. Okay, so we can actually click here to skip this, so we won't get the uh, the timeout. So let's see how it looks. As you can see, there's a lot of blood particles getting spewed all over the place. Um, it's because it's the cannon, and uh, the cannon makes them bleed more. And every every monster that takes damage is gonna bleed. So you can see here we have two, and they're gonna fall to the ground, and they're gonna start uh, disappearing. Uh, there's a bit of an offset for each of them, so they won't land on the same I don't know, the same line. There's can land four pixels away from each other, so up and down like this. So yeah, that's the mild version. Um, let's go ahead and change it to uh, bloody. Okay, and here we go. Let's see how this looks. So a lot, there's a lot more uh, blood particles in this one. So let's go ahead and turn that off and have a look at the, what the bullet tower does. So you can see that there's uh, six blood particles for each shot here. So that's a little bit more bloody. That's about the same with the mild on the um, on the bomb tower. So let's try two bomb towers here. We can't actually afford that. See, there's a lot of blood spewing all over. So yeah, that's um, what I've added. So I added the blood effect, and uh, I added the ability to skip ahead. So you don't have to, if you build all your towers and you're ready, you don't have to wait. You can just click here, and they'll start appearing. And this is also generating some blood. So yeah, that's um, I'm gonna start beginning to, uh, or I'm gonna start uh, making levels now. I think this game is about done. I'm gonna change some things, but uh, the core gameplay and stuff and the arts and stuff it's all done now so I can go ahead and make some actual playable maps that will be balanced and fun to play so that's what I'm gonna begin to do so I'll probably um, make a video once I've made some levels or something so I can show you uh, how I made the levels and why I did so and so, so on and so forth so um, hope to see you uh, next time so until then until next time take care everybody.